Hello, all right. I am gonna be checking on you periodically through the next week or so while so many of you are being quarantined and uh, maybe not going into work. Maybe your kids are home for an extended stay. And I did a whole day of coaching yesterday and you know what I did? I helped my clients determine the new normal for the next couple weeks. We talked about scheduling, things that they could take action on, and I wanna help you as well. So many people right now feel uncertain about things. They might feel panicked about things. There's a couple simple things I want you to do and take action on so you can feel better. Number one, if your kids and you are home right now, schedule out consistent meal times. Kids especially thrive with consistency. So actually taking out your calendar, saying this is when we're gonna eat, if they have schoolwork, budget time for the schoolwork. If you have work, you have to do budget time for that. What I'd love to see you do is also budget time for social interaction, whether you're in an online support group like Half Size Me Community, or whether you're calling family and friends on the phone, you're doing FaceTime, something to that effect. That needs to be on the schedule. Plan for outside activities for you and the kids. Go throw the ball around outside, go for a nature hike, go for a bike ride, if weather permits in your area. I also want to relinquish some of this fear around scarcity. I know right now you go to the grocery stores, the shelves have been cleared out, but I have talked to now two different people who are very high up in either toilet paper companies, Kimberly Clark, or in public store chains, uh, in, in grocery store chains, who have said the exact same thing. Our supply chain has not been affected. We don't understand what the fear and the panic is, why people are consuming things the way they are. And the reason I wanna share that is, is because scarcity can be the thing that drives you over the edge to purchase the Oreos, to purchase these things. Oh my God, what if they're gone? No, take a deep breath, get your essentials, make sure your family is taken care of, but kind of understand that right now people are struggling, they're trying to find something they can control and purchasing things like water, toilet paper, might, and peanut butter might feel like the things that are tangible that they can take action on. It doesn't mean we're running out of supplies. So I just wanted to share that. So please post below how you are taking positive action today. Are you scheduling? Are you making sure to put in social connection time? Are you planning outside activities for you and the kids? Make sure to let us know below because here's the deal. Every day you have control of three things, your thoughts, your actions, your perspective. Everything else is outside of your control. But if you control your thoughts, your actions, and your perspective, your personal day can be much, much better. And what I want to encourage you to do is put a time budget boundary around how much news you consume. News goal is to keep you in entranced because what they want to do is sell to you. So what you can do is set a time budget. Maybe I check the news for 15, 20 minutes in the evening, but do not allow it to run continuously and sabotage you. All right, you have a great day. I can't wait to read your post below on how you're taking positive action in your life today. And I will be back to check on you in a day or two. You guys take care, bye.